Hey, kids, good evening again. So this is the last position with the frontal checks. Now, pay attention, the pawn is on the third rank, right? So it's not on the fourth rank, but on the third. Well, we can win this position. Um, the black king is cut off, right? So we can play rook e4 here. That's an important move because you want to support the pawn, right? So pawn goes to b4. And now we go king c3. Watch this. Now, king f5. We move a little bit back, right? King f4 and this move, okay? So so now the question is king, king, can our king go forward? We are threatening b4, right? So let's see, check. We play king d4. And look, this is important here. Check. We play king d5. And what it is is like some type of uh, um, shoulder charging, you know, that we studied in previous lessons. Right here, we are going to play rook to b1. This is an important move. And see, the king on d5 is not allowing the black king to go in front of the pawn, right? That's what I meant by sh shoulder uh, charging. And now we are threatening b4, b5, b6, and, and to win the game, right? So this is, again, a very important move, like we had in a previous example. Now we have rook b1. That is very important move. So let's see a little bit more here, right? So we play rook e4 and uh, king f6, king c3. Let's see the move rook c7. All right, check. Like, what do we do here? King d4, this small, king c4, and again, we play king d5. This is important, king, king d5, because this king is going to block the black king. King f5, and here we can play rook e2. Now, rook c1, of course, uh, if, if he plays rook b7, we already know, right? Rook, uh, here we can even play a check first. You know, in, and and then play rook b2, right? So so now you you put rook from behind the pawn and you're ready to push forward, right? So what else can happen here? I mean, if um, rook c1, right? Well, not good enough because um, here b4 and uh, b5, b6, and we can support it, right? So it's uh, we can we can even play here better move, right? This move and then and then play b4, right? So so that's how you win this position. That means pay pay attention to 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 couple of moves here, like like especially rook e4. I think that's that's important. And then uh, the strategy of going with the king, like it's important to to go with the king here to d5. That's 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 important strategy where you don't allow the black king to go in front of the pawn. And that's how you win. And then, of course, this move is a key, right? Rook b1, and then you push forward. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this uh, defense by frontal checks. We studied six uh, positions. And uh, in the next uh, lessons, we, we are going to study different uh, subject. Okay, let's practice this. Put it on the chess clock 10 minutes and just play with your chess teachers or with other students in the art school program. Bye-bye. See you in the next lesson.